Hey guys, welcome back to another Sea of Thieves video. Today I'm going to show you guys some uses you can get out of empty storage crates, as many players find these crates useless and don't even bother to keep them on their ship a lot of the time, but hopefully these tips will encourage you guys to make the most out of these empty crates. You'll find that many of these uses in the video are interchangeable and you can perhaps use only one or two crates to cover most of these, but these are just the particular roles I find useful with these crates. If you guys enjoy the video, please feel free to like and subscribe, and maybe check out some other of my guides and videos. With all that being said, let's get into the video. So the first and probably my favourite use for an empty storage crate is for using it as a personal storage crate. This is basically a crate filled with the optimal supplies you would want for fighting other players, with food, wood, cannonballs, cursed, anything and everything that you'd want for PvP. This is perfect for saving time spent on grabbing supplies individually from each barrel when you're needed to get straight into the action right after coming back from an island or something similar. You just quickly dump any supplies you don't want on you and then grab your entire personal crate and you're ready for anything. So for the second use, this is what I call a barrel crate, and this is basically just an empty crate you keep at the front of your ship for grabbing all the supplies from barrels that you can harpoon around the seas. I'm just using the start of Merchant Quest to provide an example. These barrels aren't as stocked as the barrels you'll find naturally around the seas. This method will allow you to quickly grab all the supplies from these barrels instead of running back and forth from every storage barrel on your ship to the barrels of your harpooning. You can just grab it all quickly with the storage crate and then you can organise it later. Our third use is what I would call a battle crate or just a generic supplies crate. This is a crate you'd have on top deck, typically next to your cannons or masts, as this is what is used for when you're fighting other crews. It has a lot of useful supplies that you need to be restocking during your fighting. You have your cannonballs, blunders, firebombs and chains, as well as a few pieces of wood in case you have none on you and you need to patch a mast, wheel or capstan, and some food for healing. I want to stress that this isn't your typical throw all the supplies in one crate method. I strongly recommend against doing this in case enemies realise that you have all your supplies in one crate and most of the time they'll try to steal it or drop it off your ship, leaving you with no supplies. You will also be given the other crew all your supplies after you fight if you sink. This will make things really difficult for yourself if you intend on coming back to fight again, as you have given the other crew a significant amount of supplies, so be careful not to do this. So, moving on to the fourth method, we have the dump crate. This is just as simple as the name. You just dump all the supplies you have on you to empty your inventory for whatever reason. You want to keep this on top deck for ease of access and convenience. This crate is very good for when you want to jump off quickly to an island or barrels to grab more supplies when you already have a full inventory. The fifth use is a looting or siphoning crate. This is basically just a crate that you're ready to take to an island or another ship to take the supplies. This will avoid you filling up another crate that you have another use for, so you can keep things organised by keeping a spare crate for this. Our sixth and final use is a hull or bottom deck wood crate. You could also use a normal wood crate for this, but it makes no difference to use a storage crate if you have one spare. This is just a crate filled with planks that you can use to repair your ship, typically near the bottom in front of your hull, and this will help if you run out of planks in your inventory in a position where you're far from the wood barrel. So this crate is just for convenience and ease of access for planks. So guys, that is everything for this video. Hopefully you'll find some or all of these methods useful and you can use them in the future. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.